And it's a complete day. Il y a beaucoup de, de conseillers qui demandent, qui veulent continuer à parler des enjeux de la ville, qui veulent mettre de côté toute cette saga Rob Ford. Est-ce que vous pensez que c'est possible de, ch de, de changer le thème de la discussion? Euh, nous avons beaucoup de, de travail de la ville que nous euh, faisons. Je pense qu'aujourd'hui, nous pouvons voir euh, que chaque fois que le maire euh, parle euh, dans le conseil, euh, il nous euh, met notre dos à euh, la mer. Euh, et euh, c'est des choses symboliques. Mais je pense que c'est euh, ce tout ce que nous pouvons faire. C'est possible que s'il y a plus de révélations, c'est peut-être nous euh, demander de la provenance de l'action spéciale. Est-ce que c'est suffisant, oui, 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 est -ce est suffisant la motion la semaine prochaine, la semaine prochaine de demain, de réduire ses pouvoirs Qu'est-ce que ça va accomplir euh, ça donne un peu de stabilité à notre gouvernement parce que euh, euh, le maire n'a pas la possibilité de faire des actions euh, soudaines ou irrationnelles. Euh, 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 Sir, you're reacting to uh, this morning's press conference. The mayor's press was conference. Was that a press conference? Or the scrum? Or the scrum. Was some the scrum. kind of a stream of consciousness that I, I have never heard any elected official say anything like that. It is completely unbelievable, unacceptable uh, to talk about his former staff in that way, uh, to, to say what he said about his wife in public. I mean, I think he's out of control. Can we expect a well, I think we're going to take a step uh, tomorrow. I'll tell you, uh, a week ago, I wasn't prepared to take that step. You know, if you were to fire me off executive committee for uh, standing up for what's right, I would have said so be it. But now I think we're in the realm that we need to uh, stabilize uh, the government of the city of Toronto and protect it from a mayor who. Uh, I don't think is being rational, and I don't think is in control, and uh, we need to protect the institutions of this government. Do you think the Dalby executive and have control of the council? Um, that would pr be very problematic for a lot of reasons because uh, it wouldn't provide uh, residents with the ability to make deputations at executive committee uh, on issues that we're debating if you just brought all those items directly to council. So I mean, we need to try and make sure that our government functions as normally as possible. And the lady the the expressed that the, 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 what might happen here is the left now may in their own words take over or perform a coup on the government. Well, I certainly wouldn't support that. And what we're what is before council tomorrow is basically to freeze the names of council. So that is not a, a coup by the, the left. It's not in the documents, there's a lot of uh, you know, salacious things about drugs and alleged escorts, but there's also stuff about the mayor paying more to his staff in the middle of the scandal, um, you know, using his staff for personal errands, not wanting to attend you know, a lot of public events, including one by Prince. What do you think about that aspect of it? Well, I mean, it's just uh, there have been rumors about you know what his schedule has been. Nobody's been ever able. To, to pin it down, but now we've heard it from inside and so on. People expect more from the mayor of Toronto uh, than that. Uh, in, you know, in terms of looking after taxpayers' money, if uh, you know, essentially the mayor is trying to buy 
by his staff's loyalty so to buy a science by giving them when he's more riding money. Uh, that there. should be troubling to what's left of the board. There's allegations also of drinking and driving. Are we good? Yeah, we're done. I'll just drink my right here. Do you think those are the kind of things that would get to coordination? Because there are still a lot of hard work. I, you know, I'm, some of the people that uh, I, I hear on the radio stations, they're calling in that say they don't care what he does as long as he saves the money. I mean, I don't, I don't know what it would take to get through to somebody like that. What about the people who say that it's just the mayor doing things on his own free time all the time? Like clearly, that's yeah, clearly it's not. He's doing it inside um, City Hall. Uh, he's doing it uh, uh, with his staff uh, having to cover up for him and assist him and help him. Uh, it, it, he is using City Hall public taxpayers' resources uh, for this. Sir, I apologize. We just missed our. Uh, it's unbelievable, day by day, more and more comes really out, so much of it's self-inflicted, the latest, uh, the mayor's impromptu scrum uh, this morning, where the, the language that he used was just you know, inconceivable that any public official would say those things, would uh, talk about a former uh, female staff in his office in that way, and frankly even... Uh, referred to his wife in, in the way that he did. I mean, some of these are out of control. Exactly yep. Thank you very much.